Hello and welcome. This time we're going to talk about another jump, a reference variable jump. Last time we talked about a correcting variable jump, this time we are talking about a reference variable jump. Last time we said we are using this without controller. Yeah. This time we are using the controller and the closed loop and everything and we do a jump here yeah, and see how this is reacting. So this time we can tell something about the quality. Yeah, the quality of the control loop. How good it is. So we will have it W from T, there's a start value. There's an end value. And at some point in time, we do the jump. That's it. This is the signal W from T. And we are also recording the controlled variable x from t. And it might look like this. Here it should be the same. And then here we will start to increase. And then maybe we are overshooting a little bit. Yeah? And then maybe we swing around here. And then we will finally reach the new value. Draw this a little bit further. So this might be the reaction of our controlled variable. There are several characteristic variables this time here the thing until we reach the first time the desired value this is called the rise time yeah? or in German Unregelzeit rise time or Unregelzeit Here, the time it takes to the overswing, the maximum of the overswing, yeah? it's the overswing time, yeah? or in German, Überschwingzeit. The value of the overswing, overswing value, yeah? German, Überschwingweite. All right x infinity because here this is of course x infinity in infinite time we will reach this value yeah. so if the überschwing weiter if the overswing width will be 10% yeah, then we are overshooting 10% compared to this value Anregelzeit Überschwingzeit rise time, overswing time, and then there is somewhere a corridor, plus usually plus minus 2%. And if the controlled variable stays inside this plus minus 2%, which will happen at our example exactly here, yeah, this time from the beginning to this time, the control time or in German Ausregelzeit. Ausregelzeit in English also setting time. Ausregelzeit setting time. These are the characteristic parameters. So the characteristic parameters overswing time, overswing value, rise time, Anregelzeit, Ausregelzeit, 
setting time until we are within a certain bandwidth. Reference variable jump. Is this not good? Is this bad? There are some criteria. Basically, these are just parameters. Yeah? If they're good or bad, there are some criteria. Yeah? Some integral criteria. Next video, we are going to talk about those integral criteria. Next time, we are going to talk about quality criteria for the closed loop. For this time, thank you much for listening. Goodbye.